this is my Pac-Man cup. <laughs> I really like Pac-Man and I just thought that it would be a funny thing to do. I was looking for ideas online and I just randomly thought about the game and I saw a cup similar to this. And it also reminds me of the like um, theme park grapple cups. So you could just kind of grab it on the back. The bottom part is sort of like, eh, it has like a little hole in it. So it won't necessarily work as a cup, but I know what to do next time. I could definitely reprint this and make it work. So, um, and I just added a star at the bottom. I have another one that has like just um, a rectangle at the bottom, but I wanted to make it look cooler. So yeah, um, this, this is the name plates. We had to make these. Um, it was like a simple lesson from Coach Enrique. And Can like my, all of it? yeah, so, here you go, the, um, it's my name, and the letters, sorry, whoa, <laughs> the letters extrude, I sort of did that by accident in the beginning, but I kind of kept it that way because I thought that it would give off a cool look to it, um, and they're all like, some are taller than others, so I thought that it would be cool to do, and this is just the breeze block that we had to make, it's the first project, oh, Sorry, <laughs> this is the breeze block. It was our first project. And um, I accidentally made mine smaller than everybody else's, but I just knew that I wanted to add a crescent moon. And I thought, hey, stars are related. <laughs> They're also in the sky. So I added that onto it too. And it's a pretty simple design, but I was still getting used to Rhino. So that's why I kind of just um, went with the more simple approach. And as you can see, my projects have gotten crazier. <laughs> I'm currently printing a bench and um, we're trying to think of an ADA compliant thing to print in our groups. So <laughs> there's more to come, but this is what I have so far. So this right here is a grenade I make. It's a insert or used as a cup. You can lift the top part up, which acts as like a cover for it. And you can drink out of it here. And the handle is, well, the handle of the grenade is used as a normal handle and then added another handle to make more to make it look more realistic and better. What inspired you to do it? Uh, I just wanted to have a challenge to make this to make this and I also thought it would seem pretty fun to make it. Zachariah Joseph and I am a student in the Breakthrough FIU Campus 3D Printing Program. Um, this is from a show I watch called Naruto. These are his throwing knife slash kunai, but it, it's a toy for kids. They're not sharp, they're not actually sharp, so you can like play with them and like they're not sharp. But the plan was to have it and have like braille on the front. The braille wouldn't print correctly over the um the overline so we have to reprint it again but it's my favorite because it's it's like a cool little toy and it's reminds me of my childhood because i used to watch the show all the time So here is my first model of my geometric cup design. It has indentations with some ovals and it looks pretty nice. <laughs> what inspired me to make this is I've seen various designs of some geometric plant pots that my mother owns and I thought I would be able to replicate that in a cup form and it turned out better than I expected. And then I decided to add the grooves and the tactile because I thought for people who might be visually impaired, it might allow them to dis distinguish that this is their cup and maybe different grooves to help them out. Right, so this name tag, um, there really isn't like just a purpose. It's just like, cause it was like a short project to show our skills, like something very simple. Mm -hmm. And I just decided to go over the top and actually add like these star models and my name in like a different font, like a video game. And this block is like breeze block. It's like 
it regulates like the wind and everything but this one doesn't really have like much of a function i just kind of just chose this design because it was cool and uh, this, these two are game Boy cups and i made two just in case so one, if one was like too small or one was like too big so i just made both of them and uh, yeah that's, that's it my name is james um, these are my 3D projects that I've printed. The first one's just a simple name tag, and the second one is a breeze block, which provides light and airflow into a building while also providing shade. And my inspiration for doing this breeze block is the famous NBA team, the Chicago Bulls, and this is their logo, as they're one of the best NBA teams of all time.